YouTube. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? And it is your guy, East Coast Kicks 856. And yes, I'm back in the building with another one. I told y'all, I told y'all I was going to have something early for you guys. And I wasn't going to say it. But if you're looking at that thumb, thumbnail, yep, like I said, it was coming. It was coming. Big shout out now to Kicks or Us. She looked out for me. I said, yo, I need that. I need that real quick. I need that to do that video so I can get my hands on it. And like I said, I told y'all I was going to get my hands on it just to give you guys an early look. But like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button up every time. I'm always giving you guys some context, earlies. Like I said, sneaker conventions, which is going to be one coming up uh, at my man, Just Nice. Once again, I'm always going there. Every time he has some this year, I can, I'm can. i definitely going to make it to one of these sneaker cons. I'm going to make it to one or two of them. I'm going to definitely make it to them sneaker cons. Um, Yeah, man. Like I said, I'm back, baby. I'm back. But hey, what I got for y'all today. Yes. Yes. The Lost and Founds. Y'all don't understand. This is a holy grail for me. This is like the ultimate, ultimate holy grail for me. Chicago one. Like, I need this shoe so bad. Like, I had plenty of times to go ahead and get it. But dumb dumb me at the time being, I wasn't really into Jordan ones like that. And they actually grew on me. It was a certain colors that got to me. The next thing you know, I just fell in love with the Jordan ones again. Like, I remember having these pair when I was a kid. Like, that goes to show you my age. Like, yeah. So, I was around watching Michael Jordan when he came around and everything, when he got drafted and all that. Because, like I said, yeah, I was born in 85. So, I was here when Michael Jordan was here watching. So, yes, I am. I'm up there. <laughs> I'm up there, but not up there. But, yes, I have lost and fouls in my hands today. And I'm going to give you guys a review on these. Um, oh, before I even say it, before I almost forgot, before I even go on ahead and to the next one, um, be prepared, uh, on the 8th on Tuesday, Nike is supposed to be loading up some of the uh, lost and founds early review. I mean, not early review, early release on there so it's going to be selective not going to be a shock drop it's just going to be selective accounts on sneakers that i'm praying that i do with that i am able to get it i do got some folks on there if they get it i told them i said yo let me know when you get that because i need that i need that because i want to get it so i get the headache out and everything because i'm gonna tell you this right now this shoe this shoe is going to be a serious 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 problem and by far, this is the sneaker of the year. I'm sorry. Like, this is it's the Jordan 1. Like, it's the Chicago Lost and Found. It's, it's, it's the Jordan 1 of the year. So, it's topping, a, it's topping every last one of these dope releases that's coming on out. But, no talking. Let's go on ahead and let's get into this. You in the mood. I be running, keep up, gunning, stop the fighting on your word. It's what you hear, not what you heard. I'm a hate on every verb. I'm going to show you what it's worth every day I'm on it. Till they put me in the dirt I'ma get into it first Said I'ma get into it first Until they put me in the dirt Said I'ma get into it first Said I'ma get into it I can't break, that's the thing about me uh, I won't put these goals on freeze I can't break, that's the thing about me uh, I won't put these goals and my oh my look what just landed in the vault i wish these were my size because i'd have definitely definitely paid it and kept it but they're not my size but i wanted to go ahead and get it and give you guys an early look at these and as you can see right here we got the jordan one lost in Chicago OG highs. Listen, when I say I'm geeked up, I'm geeked up for this. Like, I didn't put money away. Like, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm probably going to go for a triple. 
I got to go for a triple. Like, I have to get three pairs of socks. No, I have to. One to sell. Definitely one to, one to hold on the toe. I got to hold it as a display and one to wear. Like, I have to. Like, I will pay that, three, that $300, $400 plus four, three pairs. I'll do it. Like, I will do it just strictly for these. As you can see right here, we got the OG Nike box, lost and found. Now, if you notice, it gave it the vintage look, which I love it because this was the shoe that just took by storm when Michael Jordan was playing in Chicago. Like, I, I yeah, when he got drafted, I think this shoe came out in 85. Definitely 85. That was the year I was born. So, yeah. And I remember looking at pictures when my dad and them bought me little booties and everything of these. Back then, these Jordans, they were like 59, not like 59 bucks or whatever. Like, very, very affordable. Now, back in the day, that was considered high. That was considered high. Any shoe that was like over $45, $50, $60, that was considered high back in the day. Like I said, I'm starting to show my age a little bit. I'm showing my age a little bit. I'm I'm I'm, 80, I'm an 80s baby, but if you look at it now, to from back then to now, man, oh man, I'm gonna tell you this right now. Ooh, boy, that long time investment, man. These J's are going for like two, three thousand dollars, five thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, and it's it's crazy, man. It's crazy. Let's go on ahead and get into this shoe. Because, like, I don't even want to talk too much about it. That's how crazy it is. As you can see, it definitely does come with this. And I remember these. I remember East Bay used to have these, too, when I was younger. And um, Champs, it was another sneaker store that I used to go to out in um, Clementon, out there in Blackwood. Years ago, I remember we used to have these. You know, like these were the receipts back in the day, like the sneaker receipts. Like y'all see this right here? Like look, this this is this is dope, man. This is dope. Like, uh, Air Jordan One Retro High OG Varsity Red Black Cell Muslin. Mm. This is an eight and a half, and the retail price of this is one eighty. But these are going, if you want it early, I, if you really want to invest it early, I'm being honest with you, I recommend you do. Because when I say this is going to go bananas, this is going to go bananas. It's going to go crazy. And when I say crazy, I mean crazy. But yes, retail price is $180 for these. This is an eight and a half, so. Ugh. Mm. Ooh, let's open this up, man. Let's open this up. Look at the paper, man. Look, listen. This is a box that you gotta keep. Y'all remember this from the East Bay commercial, uh, from the East Bay uh, books and everything from back in the day? Like, man, we used to look forward to these, yo. Like, look at the look at the price on there. It's, it's crazy. Fifty nine ninety nine. Like. Times have changed, man. Times have dramatically changed. It definitely does come. Now, I'm going to tell you all this right now. There's some fakes going around, so be careful. So, it's not two of these. It's one of these. It's only one. So, if you see two receipts in here, get your money back. Don't even buy it. Or just don't even wear it at all. Because it comes with one receipt, y'all. One receipt. One receipt. Mm. Oh. oh oh my god i finally i finally got a hand got a got a got this in my hands man when i go ahead i'm getting my three size nines i'm sorry i gotta get my three size nines right. Ooh, look at these 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 look at, these. Look at these, OMG, OMG, man, listen, y'all see how crazy this is, do y'all see how crazy this is, like, this is the ultimate grail, I'm sorry, this is the ultimate grail, like, 
This is the ultimate grail. Like, right. look at it, man. Oh, and it definitely does not come in your typical regular um, shoestring bag like you usually do. And these ones, they come straight laced up, double lace. So you got your red lace and your black lace, and they come up lined up like that. But look at this. Look at this, y'all. Look at this. <sighs> These things are a beauty, man. Oh, my God. Got the vintage thing on here. I, I love it. I'm sorry. I love it. Like, I got to get, I got to get, I got to get three pairs, man. I got to. I have to get three pairs. It's only right for me to have this. Like, this is the shoe of all shoes. This is the shoe of all shoes. Like, it's going to be crazy. I'm going to let this be known to y'all right now. So y'all better get your money on up. Y'all better do what y'all got to do. Like, do all the footwork as you can. Because I'm telling you, this is going to get nuts. I wouldn't be surprised if you see a lot of fights over this shoe. Like, literally, it's going to be some fights. So, can't say I ain't warn you. So, to the people who did the back door and everything, man, look, I ain't even mad at y'all for it. I'm probably might going to go ahead and do it, but I mean, I got good luck. And I mean, I'm good at what I do, so I'm always going to have it in my hand, personally. But I, I'm going to need about three personal pairs. I'm going to need three of them. But these, <sighs> mm, 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 mm. 10 out of 10. I'm sorry, man, hell with that. 100 out of 100. Like, that's how great i want these shoes like and i finally able to go ahead and get that like this time i'm not gonna be stupid and mess around and oh no i'm past past no I'm, I'm gonna get it because i'm not because i'm telling you if you don't get them they're gonna go back on up they're gonna they're gonna hit six seven eight hundred i wouldn't be i wouldn't be surprised if they hit a thousand mark they're gonna hit that thousand mark maybe a little bit hard but they're gonna hit that thousand mark mark my word but hey Comment down below. Let me know how you feel about these Air Jordan 1 Chicago's the OGs lost and found. This is a must cop. I don't want to hear it say, oh, it's a pass. No, this is a must cop. I'm not even going to sit there saying, is it a pass or a cop? This is a must cop. A must cop, period. You hear me? It is a cop. If you got it, just go on ahead if you catch it at a good price, if they if it's certain size is going for like three something, whatever, take it. Take that price. Because I'm going to tell you this right now. If you don't take that price, later on, it's going to go on up and you're going to regret it and you're going to be pissed about it. Because when they start hitting that 900,000 mark, you're going to be having that, that sad face, man. But look, it is your boy, East Coast Kiss 856, giving you another early review so comment down below let me know what you think about these lost and frowns it is your boy east coast kicks man and i am signing out